Otherwise, we are going to get started whenever you're ready. Let's get up onto our feet. And let's take a big breath in. And big breath out. And taking a nice big breath in. And big breath out. And one more. And exhale. Taking a deep breath in. And exhale, bowing forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, relaxing down, soften our knees and slowly finding our way all the way up. Exhale, bringing hands to heart, hands to side and reach. Exhale, bowing forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, relaxing down, soften our knees and slowly finding our way all the way up. Exhale, bringing hands to heart. Hands to side and one more. And exhale, bowing forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, relaxing down, soften our knees and slowly finding our way back up. Exhale, bringing hands to heart. Hands to side, this time adding on. Exhale, bow forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, bringing our hands onto the ground, jump, step, or float, feet back into plank, keeping elbows hugged in, coming down through what we call chaturanga. Inhale, lifting up heart into cobra or upward facing dog, tuck your toes, and stretch back into your first downward facing dog and walk through the feet. Bending into one knee, coming up onto the balls of the feet and bending into the other. And when you are ready, soften your knees, looking past your hands, jump step or float, feet forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, relaxing down, let soften knees and slowly finding your way all the way up. Exhale, bringing hands to heart, hands to side and reach. Exhale, bowing forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, bringing hands onto the ground, jump step or float, feet back into plank, coming down through chaturanga. Scooping heart up into upward facing dog, tuck your toes, stretching back into downward facing dog, walking through the feet. And when you're ready, let's pick up our left foot, taking a big breath in on the exhale, lean forehead. And inhale, reaching back, exhaling, knee to forehead. Inhaling, reach back, two more. Knee to forehead, inhaling, reach back, one more. Knee to forehead, inhaling, reaching back, bending knee, stacking left hip over right hip and breathing. Taking nice deep breaths in. And deep breath out. One more big breath, slowly unstack when you are ready, bringing it into pigeon, taking left knee behind left wrist and coming all the way up and breathe. If it feels okay to come all the way down onto your forearms, please do. Taking those big breaths in and big breath out. And one more big breath, using your hands to guide you, bringing hands down, tuck toes, reaching it back into a three-legged dog, bending knees, stacking hips, taking nice deep breaths in, and deep breath out. One more big breath, slowly unstack, taking left knee to left upper arm, and inhaling, reach back. 
and left knee, left upper arm. Inhaling, reach back in two more. Left knee, left upper arm. Inhaling, reach back one more. Left knee, left upper arm. Inhaling, reach back. This time, stepping that left foot onto the outside of left hand, bringing it into a lizard. So knee is directly over ankle as we breathe. If it feels okay and you'd like to come down onto your forearms, please do. As we take those deep breaths in and deep breath out. Hugging that left knee in towards your shoulder. And one more big breath whenever you're ready. Slowly finding our way back up into a three-legged dog, bending knee, stacking hip, making sure we're not dumping a lot into our right shoulder, making sure both hands are equal. And slowly unstack, coming back to neutral, taking left knee over towards right upper arm. And inhale, reach back. Left knee, right upper arm. Inhale, reach back, and two more. Last one. This time, stamping left foot between your hands, coming into a crescent lunge. Back knee comes down. Coming all the way up, reaching arms up as we breathe, taking those big breaths in and big breath out. And slowly bringing hands together, we are going to come into a twist. So taking right elbow over as we come into prayer to that left side. And if it feels okay. Tucking back toes and bringing it into a twist. Seeing if we can open up our heart just a little bit more as we take those big breaths in and big breath out. One more big breath on the exhale, both hands down. And stepping it back into downward dog, coming back up to high plank, down through chaturanga, keeping those elbows hugged in, scooping heart up into upward facing dog, tuck toes, stretching back and two more. Up to high plank, down through chaturanga, scooping heart up into upward facing dog, tuck toes, stretching back one more. Up to high plank, down. Scooping heart up and tuck, reaching back, picking up our right foot this time. Big breath in on the exhale, knee to forehead. Inhale, reach back, exhaling, knee to forehead. Inhale, reach back, exhaling, knee to forehead. One more. And knee to forehead, reaching it back, bending knee, stacking hip as we breathe. One more big breath, slowly on stack. Let's bring it into pigeon, taking that right knee behind right wrist, coming all the way up. Evening out our pelvis, flexing that front foot. And if it feels okay to come down onto our forearm, lengthening the spine, please do. We're really breathing into our glutes. Taking those deep breaths in. And deep breath out. And one more big breath on the exhale, bringing our hands, walking them back up, tucking toes, 
Coming back into three-legged dog, bending knees, back and hip, reaching your toes. And taking those nice deep breaths in and deep breath out. And one more big breath coming back to center, taking right knee to right upper arm. And inhaling, reaching back and right knee, right upper arm. Inhaling, reaching back and right knee, right upper arm. Inhaling, reaching back, one more. And inhaling, reaching back, stepping our right foot onto the outside. Out that hand, really breathing. And taking those deep breaths in. And deep breath out. Coming down onto your forearms if you'd like. And feeling yourself taking a big breath in on the exhale when you're ready. Coming all the way up, bending knees, stacking hip. Feeling that lengthening along the right side of the body. And one more big breath, slowly coming back to center. And when we are ready, taking right knee to left upper arm. Inhaling, reaching back and twist and reach and twist and reach one more and reach. Stepping foot in between hands, taking back knee down and coming all the way up into a crescent lunge, really breathing, taking those deep breaths in. And deep breath out. And two more big breaths. And slowly bringing hands forward when you're ready. Let's gently take our left elbow over to right side if it feels okay to tuck back toes and pick up back knee, please do. And one more big breath on the exhale. Both hands come back down. Reach it back into three-legged dog, bending knees, stack and hip. And really reaching those toes. And one more big breath. Slowly on stack both feet on the ground. Softening your knees, looking past your hands, jump step or float feet forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, relaxing down, let's soften our knees and slowly coming all the way up. Exhale, bringing hands to heart and hands to side and inhale, reach them up. Exhale, bowing forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, bringing hands onto the ground, jump step or float feet back into plank and come down for chaturanga. Scooping heart up into upward facing dog, stretching back into downward dog, coming back up to high plank. And we are going to twist to the left. So bringing right hand underneath, right shoulder, reaching up. Lengthening your spine. Pulling up through pelvic floor. One more big breath on the exhale, coming the opposite way onto the other side. Find that foundation first and foremost. Left hand directly underneath. 
left shoulder. And one more big breath on the exhale back to center, coming down through Chaturanga, scooping hard up into upward facing dog, tuck your toes, stretching back into downward facing dog. And let's pick up our right foot. Exhale, knee to forehead. Inhale, reach back. Exhale, knee to forehead. Inhale, reach back. Exhaling, knee to forehead. Inhale, reach back. Knee to forehead. Four more. Four. Three. Two. And one. This time, stepping foot all the way through. We are going to come into a warrior two. So, opening up back foot, coming all the way up and taking that bow and arrow and reaching right arm forward, left back as we breathe. Taking big breaths in and big breath out. Just bringing shoulders up, roll them back. And slowly taking arms behind back, shoulders roll back, bringing it into a humble warrior. And breathe. Taking nice deep breaths in and deep breath out. And one more big breath on the exhale, finding our way back up. Let's straighten front knee, reaching it into triangle. Feeling tall form, really reaching to the sky as we open up. That top shoulder reaching that left hip back. And on the inhale, slowly coming back up to warrior two. Let's turn our front palm up and exalt your warrior, softening into your front knee, lifting heart, taking deep breaths in. And deep breath out. And when we are ready, we are going to bring our hands to the ground. Option one is just taking that right hand just along the outside. So option one, both feet on the ground. Option two is to stack that left hip on top of right hip. And if it feels okay, reaching your left arm back to reach the top of your foot and gently push foot into hand. One more big breath on the exhale, both hands down, stepping both feet back and coming back up to high plank down through Chaturanga, scooping heart up into upward facing dog, tuck toes, stretching back and reaching all the way down through Chaturanga, scooping heart up into upward facing dog, tuck toes, stretching back and one more. And down, scooping heart up, tucking toes, and stretching back, picking up left foot, big breath in on the exhale, knee to forehead. Inhaling, reach back, knee to forehead. Inhaling, reach back, knee to forehead. Inhaling, reach back, knee to forehead. Inhale, reach back, four more. Three, two, 
and one this time stepping foot in between him we are coming into warrior two on the other side so opening up that foot for power taking left arm forward i am going to turn around so you can see what i am doing so very carefully reaching that warrior two really breathe and when you're ready arms come back shoulders back and gently reaching into that humble warrior. And one more big breath on the inhale, coming back up, releasing hands, and let's reach all the way, taking back hand all the way up to the sky into a triangle. Really reach, feeling top shoulder, reaching up to the sky. And one more big breath whenever you're ready, rooting into that front knee, softening it and exalting the warrior by reaching our left arm up to the sky. Taking nice deep breaths in and deep breath out, really breathing in through the bottoms of the feet. And one more big breath, slowly bringing hands all the way down, rooting left hand into the ground. If it feels okay, let's open up, side body, soft the knee. And if you can, reaching to grab the top of the foot and press. Really breathe. One more big breath when you're ready, slowly and wrap, stepping both feet back and coming back up to high plank down for Chaturanga. Scooping heart up into upward facing dog, tuck toes. Stretching back into downward dog and coming back up high plank down. Scooping heart up and reaching back. And when you are ready, softening into both knees, looking past your hands, jump step or float feet forward. Inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale, relax and down, soften your knees. And let's find your way all the way back up. Exhaling, bringing hands to heart and hands to sides and breathe. Taking nice deep breaths in and deep breath out. And when you are ready, feet about hip distance apart, softening your knees, reaching hips back, arms float out into chair as we breathe. Taking those deep breaths in. And deep breath out. One more big breath on the exhale, coming into a forward fold and inhaling for a halfway lift. Exhale. 
relaxing down, let's soften the knee and slowly coming all the way up. Exhale, bringing hands to heart, hands to sides. And when you're ready, let's root into our right foot. Let's take left leg into tree. So option one is right over ankle, two is calf, three is thigh. So just seeing for you what feels best, finding a spot to look at that is not moving. And one more big breath on the exhale, coming back to both feet, taking deep breath in and deep breath out. And when you're ready, rooting and other foot. So finding that foundation. Really breathe. And one more big breath on the exhale, both feet breathing in. And coming all the way down, toes out to the sides. And whenever you're ready, soften the knees, coming down into the solid. Nice long spine as we breathe. Taking those deep breaths in and deep breath out. And one more big breath on the exhale, bringing hands down. Option one is to straighten the legs and just shifting hips side to side, allowing the head to relax. And when you're ready, coming back down again, softening knees, shoulders back, really breathe. Taking those deep breaths in and deep breath out. And whenever you're ready, bringing hands down. Option one is to straighten the legs again, coming into a forward fold. Option two, if crow is in your practice, so just gently bringing knees to the backs of the arms, taking one, possibly two, as we breathe. Taking those deep breaths in and deep breath out.
And whenever you're ready, both hands onto the ground, everybody lifting hips to the sky. And just allowing your head to relax as we shift side to side. And slowly coming back to center, coming all the way down onto our tummy. And when you are ready, turning your head to the side, engaging your glutes, your legs, your back, your abdomen, and on your inhale, really bringing the legs a little closer together. On the inhale, bringing up head, neck, and shoulder. Arms, if you are able to bring chest and solar plexus up too, please, please, please do. Making sure there's no crunching in the back where it's painful. Really breathe. And one more big breath on the exhale. Turn your head to the right and give your hips a bit of a wiggle just allowing them to release. And slowly finding our way back to center, feeling the engagement of our feet, legs, back and torso, shoulders. And this time reaching up, if it feels okay, taking feet off the ground too, this round. One more big breath on the exhale, relaxing down, turning head to the left, bringing feet back down, everything down, giving it a little bit of a wiggle just to release. And slowly coming back to center, feeling the engagement of the legs, the glutes. And when you're ready, shoulders back interlace, coming up, feeling tops of the feet on the ground as we breathe. And one more big breath on the exhale, release, turning head to the side, giving our hips a little bit of a wiggle, releasing, breathing deeply. Slowly shoulders back, interlace whenever you're ready, bringing up head, neck, chest, legs, feeling that engagement. And one more big breath on the exhale, coming back down, turning head to the side, arms down, unwrapped hands, and giving hips a bit of a wiggle. And whenever you're ready, Let's find your way onto our backs. Knees to the ceiling, feet, hip distance apart. And whenever you're down, very carefully, arms by your sides. 
Taking a deep breath in and on the exhale, lifting up pelvis, stomach, chest, if it feels okay to interlace fingers, coming up onto the blades of the shoulders, please do. And taking those deep breaths in and deep breath out. And one more big breath on the exhale, release. And if it feels okay, reaching arms, soften your elbows, palms on the ground. And whenever you're ready, option one is interlacing hands behind as we lift hips. Option two, pressing into your fingers. As we come up, coming all the way up onto the head, if this is in your practice, you do not have neck injuries and coming into a full extension of the shape if this is in your practice. Really breathe. Taking those big breaths in and big breath out. Whenever you need to come down for those of you in full extension, you're going to bring head down first, very carefully tucking chin in towards chest as you roll back down whenever you're ready, but staying here for a little bit. And whenever you're ready, whichever variation you are in this shape, very carefully, slowly, finding your way all the way down. If your neck is feeling healthy, bringing knees in towards chest, bringing head up towards your knees, really breathing. Taking big breaths in and big breath out. Slowly coming all the way down knees and very gently knees from side to side. And slowly coming back to center, extending the legs all the way up to the sky. And imagine having an elastic around your ankles. And on the inhale, opening the legs up for one, two, three, four, squeezing inner thighs, bringing it back together, five, six, seven, eight, and reach one, two, three, Four and squeezing five, six, seven, eight, reaching one, two, three, four, and squeeze six, seven, eight, reaching one, two, three, four, squeeze five, six, seven, eight, reaching one, two, three, four, squeeze, five, six, seven, eight, and reach, two, three, four, and squeeze, six, seven, eight, and one more, two, three, Four, squeeze, five, six, seven, and shake it out. Nice work. And reaching toes all the way up and very carefully bending our knees, knees stacked over our hips, very carefully side to side, inhaling through center, 
keeping knees over hips. Exhale as we come to the side. Big breath in and big breath out. Keeping both shoulders on the ground, trying to keep neck relaxed. And one more on each side. Coming back to center, shaking it out if you'd like. Otherwise, resetting and gently tapping. Toes down, knees over hips, belly button pulled in, feeling your low back reaching towards the ground. Checking if you're still breathing. And one more on each side. Checking your low back. Extending both legs up, reaching one down. One up. And release both feet on the ground and very gently. Knees from side to side, just releasing our low back. And coming back to center, hugging right knee in towards chest. And when you're ready, crossing right leg over left leg, opening up right arm to the side and guiding your knees, keeping both shoulders on the ground as we guide, knees over to the left. And one more big breath on the exhale slowly, coming back to center and changing. Opposite leg, hugging knee in towards chest, relaxing neck and shoulders. And whenever you're ready, crossing, left over right, turning to the side, very carefully guiding. Knees over towards that side as you breathe. And on your inhalation, slowly finding your way back to center, releasing legs, reaching arms and legs to opposite end to yawn. 
and stretch, feeling fresh, cool air coming in, warm air coming out. And softening arms, softening legs. Slowly reaching legs up to the sky, bringing it into what we call a happy baby. Reaching for thighs, calves, or toes. Feeling your tailbone reach into the ground as we breathe. And if it feels okay, gently rocking from side to side. And slowly finding your way back to center, releasing arms, releasing legs. And whenever you're ready, one more time, bringing you into a starfish to yawn and stretch, feeling fresh, cool air coming in, warm air coming out and slowly allowing your arms to melt down to your side. Palms facing up to receive energy or palms down to ground. Taking a nice deep breath in and exhale. And slowly feeling movement returning to fingers, toes, hands, and feet. If you'd like to reach your arms above your head to yawn and stretch, please do. Feeling fresh, cool air coming in, warm air coming out. And gently yawning, stretching, slowly rolling to one side and using your arms to guide you, slowly finding your way back up to a tall feet, feeling your sits bones melting into the earth, your crown reaching up to the sky and taking a big breath in. And on your exhale, bowing to thank yourself. And I thank you too. Namaste, everyone. <laughs>